Hey, people of Hope. Pastor Mike here. You see, the other day on, on Friday, I, I, you won't believe this, but I went out fishing. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I was trying to go for those really big walleyes that are really fun to catch right now. Hopefully get one of those really great Facebook pictures or maybe it would be big enough yet to get an honorary trip and spot on my wall. And as I was going up and I was, I was jigging and as I'm jigging, all of a sudden, man, I, I launched into a really big fish and it wasn't a northern. I, I could just tell the head shakes were, were screaming. It's a walleye. And as I'm reeling this thing in thinking this is a 28, 29, 30 inch fish, all of a sudden I went, that's, that's no walleye. That's a two foot long sucker. And it's a fat one at that. <laughs> It was kind of disappointing. But you know what? I was able to take that disappointment, that two-foot-long sucker, and I, I brought it home and I smoked it. And let me tell you what, it's delicious. <laughs> we have a lot of disappointments going on in our life right now. The serious disappointments, not just catching suckers versus walleyes. We got some serious disappointments. Maybe it's a, a graduation that's going to look a little different. Maybe it's a funeral of a loved one where you weren't able to celebrate the life of a person the way you wanted to or the way they wanted to. Maybe it's a wedding that's been postponed or moved up or whatever it looks like. It's just not what it was supposed to be. Whatever disappointment you're going through right now, I want you to know this, that we have a God who works wonders in disappointment. We have a God who took the most disappointing day in human history, Good Friday, the day when humankind killed God, killed Jesus Christ. And he took that disappointment, and he changed it into the, the righteousness of humankind. He took Good Friday and he transformed it into Easter. He took death and he gave eternal life. We have a God who takes disappointment and gives us far better back than what we could ever imagine. Your disappointment's real. But know that we have a God who's making all things, all people, you, new. And when he's working in your situations, he's taking disappointment and he's bringing about new life. I hope to see you folks soon. Love you.